It's that time, it's Feel Good Friday. In this video, I share three short stories to make you smile. We may be in the middle of a winter lockdown, but there are still plenty of reasons to be cheerful. Here are a few upbeat stories from around the world to lift your mood. Here we go. Animal adoptions on track. A campaign to promote animal adoptions has been a hit with Moscow commuters. 13 of the city's animal shelters joined forces to turn a standard metro train into the Tails and Paws train. The Tails and Paws interior is plastered with photographs of cats and dogs living in animal shelters in the city. Next to each image is a QR code that people can scan to read a profile of the animal and decide if they want to adopt it. In just one week, 22 animals featured in the Tails and Paws train found forever homes. That's pawsome. Sorry, I couldn't resist. Next up is Kind Gift for Max. The incredible story of Max Woozy, the Devon lad who has been campaigning in his garden since March, got even better this week. During the first lockdown, Max vowed to sleep in his tent until the COVID-19 crisis was over. The 11-year-old has stuck to his word and nine months later is still sleeping outdoors, a feat that has so far raised 128,000 for North Devon Hospice. This week, we learn Max is braving the elements with the help of a specialist sleeping bag. He'd need it, it's bitterly cold out there. Donated to him by the mother of a fallen soldier. Lisa Snow of Cheshire was moved by Max's efforts that she gave him her late son's sleeping bag. Joseph Berry, a former scout who was mad about camping, died at age 21 while serving in Afghanistan. Max told the North Devon Gazette, I feel so happy that I remind Lisa of Joe. I'm so proud to say that I'll be using a soldier's sleeping bag because I'm just a boy sleeping in a tent while he was, a bra while he was brave and served his country. Next up, and finally, wildlife discoveries. 2020 was tough on the health and economic fronts, but it proved to be a boom for bioscientists who discovered hundreds of new animal species. Among the newly identified creatures was a beaked whale, spotted in, spotted in Mexican waters, an acute little primate called Popa Longor that looks like it's wearing white eyeliner. Meanwhile, in northern India, a new species of emerald green viper has been named Trimerosaurus Salazar. That's a mouthful. Harry Potter's fans might recognise that this is a reference to Salazar Slytherin, the cunning founder of the House of Slytherin. Slytherin's mascot is a snake and its house colour is green. That's all from us here at Love M44. Thanks for watching. Be nice, be kind, stay safe, and I'll see you again soon for hopefully another Feel Good Friday.